you ever wonder how the great white sharks, the apex predators of the ocean, can detect their prey even from miles away? The vast expanse of the ocean is home to a myriad of creatures, each with their unique abilities and adaptations. Yet there is one creature that stands out among the rest, dominating the ocean with its presence, the great white shark. This fearsome predator is not only the largest predatory fish on Earth, but also a marvel of evolutionary adaptation. Among the many impressive abilities that make the great white shark the ultimate predator is a remarkable sensory power known as electroreception. This is an almost otherworldly sense that allows these creatures to perceive their world in a way that we humans can barely comprehend. Electroreception enables the great white shark to detect the electrical fields produced by other animals. Every living creature emits an electrical field, from the smallest plankton to the largest whale. These fields are created by the very process of life itself, from the beating of a heart to the contraction of a muscle. The great white shark can detect these fields with an astonishing degree of sensitivity. They can sense variations as small as half a billionth of a volt. To put this into perspective, that's like detecting the electrical field produced by a flashlight battery from a distance of nearly a thousand miles. This incredible ability is made possible by a network of jelly-filled pores on the shark's snout, known as the ampullae of Lorenzini. Named after the Italian scientist who first discovered them, these pores are essentially biological sensors tuned to the minute electrical fields produced by other animals. With this superpower, the great white shark can locate its prey even when it's hiding, making it an unparalleled hunter in the ocean's depths. The faintest heartbeat of a seal tucked away in a crevice or beneath the sand cannot escape the detection of this magnificent creature. This impressive ability makes the great white shark a superb hunter, capable of detecting even the faintest heartbeat of a hiding seal. Did you know that the great white shark is not just a surface dweller, but a deep sea traveler as well? That's right, my friends. These majestic creatures are not bound to the shallows. They dive. They plunge into the depths, far below the reach of sunlight, into a world as mysterious and uncharted as the furthest reaches of space. We often think of sharks as creatures of the surface, basking in the warmth of the sun, prowling the shallow waters for their next meal. But the great white shark, it breaks this mold. It's not uncommon for these sharks to dive more than a thousand meters deep. That's deeper than most submarines dare to venture. This ability to dive so deep is quite unusual for most shark species. It is a testament to the great white's adaptability and resilience. To withstand the cold, the pressure, the darkness, it takes a creature of exceptional fortitude. And yet the great white does so with aplomb. Why do they venture so far down, you ask? Well, this deep dive allows them to explore a vast range of habitats. From the sunlit shallows to the inky blackness of the deep sea, the great white shark is a master of all it surveys. This adaptability allows them to catch a wide variety of prey. From seals and fish in the sunlit waters to squid and other deep sea creatures in the abyss, the great white's menu is as varied as the ocean itself. So, the next time you gaze out over the ocean, think of what lies beneath. The surface is but a sliver of the world that the great white shark calls home. Below, in the cold, dark depths, the great white travels, hunts, survives. It is a testament to the incredible diversity and adaptability of life on Earth. So, the next time you think of a deep sea creature, remember, the great white shark might just be lurking in the darkness below. Ever thought that sharks could be intelligent learners too? You might be surprised to learn that great white sharks, often feared as the ocean's most ruthless predators, are actually quite the scholars of the sea. Recent studies have shed light on the cognitive abilities of these magnificent creatures. It turns out that great whites are not just instinctive hunters, but intelligent beings capable of learning from their experiences. They demonstrate a level of strategic thinking that is truly fascinating. For instance, researchers have found that great whites are able to remember specific hunting grounds teeming with prey. They not only remember these areas, but return to them year after year. 
indicating a strong sense of spatial memory, a trait that is traditionally associated with mammals rather than fish. This is no small feat, considering the vastness of the ocean and the nomadic lifestyle of these sharks. It suggests that great whites can form cognitive maps of their environment and use these mental images to navigate through the open seas. This is a clear testament to their learning capabilities and their remarkable adaptability to their ever-changing surroundings. Moreover, these sharks are not just learners, but also teachers. Observations have shown that younger sharks often follow older, more experienced ones, learning from their hunting techniques and survival strategies. This social learning indicates a level of complexity in their behavior that is rarely seen in fish. But perhaps the most compelling evidence of their intelligence is their ability to modify their behavior based on their experiences. Sharks that have encountered human intervention, such as tagging, often change their behavior to avoid similar interactions in the future. So, the next time you find yourself thinking of sharks, remember this. They are not just mindless killers, they are strategic hunters, capable of learning and adapting to their environment. These findings challenge the common perception of sharks as mindless killers and portray them as thoughtful and strategic predators. The great white shark's breeding habits remain one of the ocean's greatest mysteries, but why is that? This enigma begins with the shark's elusive nature. Great white sharks are solitary creatures. They roam the vast expanses of the world's oceans, often traveling thousands of miles alone. This solitary lifestyle makes observing their breeding habits a formidable challenge for researchers. There is a distinct absence of information regarding the breeding habits of these magnificent creatures. This isn't due to a lack of interest or effort on the part of the scientific community. Rather, it's an outcome of the Great White's inherently elusive nature. The Great White Shark doesn't congregate in large numbers, nor do they return to specific breeding grounds like some other marine species. Instead, they roam the depths of the ocean far from prying eyes. The vast and often inhospitable environment they inhabit further complicates our attempts to unravel their breeding secrets. Adding to the mystery, no one has ever witnessed a great white shark giving birth or mating in the wild. Unlike other species where mating rituals or birthing can be observed, the great white's breeding remains an event shrouded in mystery and conjecture. Many theories have been proposed, some suggest that the females give birth in the open ocean, while others believe that they may seek out secluded areas, like underwater caves or deep trenches. But without definitive proof, these remain just theories. We have made significant strides in understanding these apex predators. Their migration patterns, hunting strategies, and even their social structures have been studied extensively. But when it comes to their reproduction, we're still largely in the dark. As we continue to probe the depths of our oceans and develop new research techniques, there is hope that we may someday unlock this mystery. But for now, the breeding habits of the great white shark remain one of nature's best kept secrets. Despite our advances in technology and research methods, the great white shark continues to elude us, keeping its reproductive secrets well hidden. Just how long does the king of the ocean, the great white shark, live for? It's a question that has intrigued scientists and shark enthusiasts alike for years. The answer, however, is quite surprising. The great white shark, a creature of immense power and beauty, has a lifespan that is as impressive as its size. For the queen of the sea, the female great white shark, her reign stretches over an astonishing estimated 70 years or more. This makes her one of the longest lived of all the cartilaginous fish currently known to us. A reign that spans decades, not merely years. She is a true testament to the resilience and longevity of nature's most formidable marine predators. But what about the males, you ask? Well, their rule over the ocean blue is slightly less extended, although still impressive. Males typically live for a shorter period, but it's not a fleeting reign by any stretch of the imagination. They are estimated to live for about 60 to 70 years, still a considerable span in the animal kingdom. 
The Great White's long life is not just a testament to its resilience, but also its adaptability. These sharks have roamed the oceans for millions of years, surviving countless changes in the Earth's climate and oceans. They've seen the world change around them, adapting, learning and thriving in the face of adversity. Their long lives allow them to accumulate a wealth of knowledge and experience, making them some of the ocean's most seasoned navigators and hunters. These estimates of the Great White's lifespan are just that, estimates. Scientists are still learning about these fascinating creatures. Each new discovery brings us a step closer to understanding the Great White Shark's incredible journey through life, from the moment they are born to the day they die of old age, decades later. So, the reign of the Great White in our oceans is not a fleeting one, but a rule that spans decades. The Great White Shark truly is a king and queen of longevity in the sea, a testament to the marvels of marine life.